CDC 27 conducts quarterly surveys. We always want to know what is important to you. Well, it turns out one of the biggest concerns of ABC 27 viewers is crime. So our, our Ireland Viscount went out around the mid-state to find out how bad is serious crime? I'm lucky to be alive every time I walk in my crib. I can get shot any day. Steven says he has been shot at See before. That? See them bullet holes there? This is when there, I was sitting here and I went running in my house. These bullets here almost went in my body. You wouldn't think that crime is down, but the numbers aren't going to lie. To date in Dauphin County, murders, burglaries and assaults are down from 2022. This is according to the Pennsylvania Uniform Crime Reporting System. The city of Harrisburg had 22 homicides last year. So far this year, 12. It's down for a couple of different reasons. Um, we have a lot going on here. The main things that we've been doing here uh, is uh, saturation details. We had several officers out. They're doing um, details uh, out on the street trying to get guns and curb some of the violence that's been taking place. In York County today, murders, burglaries, and assaults also down from last year. So what if I told you actually statistically that crime is down? Would you believe it? No. That's crazy. Crime ain't down around here. York City Police say they have several key initiatives to address the problem. We identify specific members of the community uh, who are involved in gun violence and we reach out to those individuals and we let them know, hey, we know what you're doing. You know, we know that you're out here, you know, carrying guns, shooting. Uh, you know, we may not have enough for charges right now, but we're watching you. Lentz added that support and resources are provided for those interested in pursuing a different lifestyle. One individual just needed an alarm clock, you know, that was what they needed to. Uh, you know, kind of turn their life around, just get to work and get to school or whatever. And, uh, you know, it was a simple request and we haven't heard from that individual since. They haven't been involved in any violence. In Lancaster County to date, burglaries and assaults are also down from last year. And so far this year, there is one more murder than last. It's great to hear. I don't see a lot of crime around much. The Lancaster City Police Bureau takes pride in their ability to investigate all types of crimes, distinguishing themselves from other areas. Our criminal investigative division, we have a property crimes unit, a violent crime unit, and a special investigations unit, uh, which we tend to all crimes. As crime is down across the mid-state, the question remains, why do people commit crimes? Whelan says love, money, and drugs. But also my biggest opinion on how this kind of stuff happens, and it's it may not be the most popular thing out there in the world, but it's violent entertainment and uh, lack of parenting, parental failure. It's just the games, call of duty, grow up. The parents ain't disciplining the kids now. Every officer I spoke with emphasized their ongoing effort to develop new initiatives aimed at reducing crime. However, they stress the importance of community collaboration to achieve these goals. Ireland Viscount, ABC 27 News.